What do we think is the biggest shock from the Masters? Biggest shock? Yeah, if we had to pick anything. I Phil mean, Mickelson. Yeah. yeah. So uh, or saying. Sam Bennett. Uh, I was going to say, Sam Bennett was the winner he of the balled, Masters. He balled out. He's, and, yeah. he's, you know, it's funny. It's like, it, you know, and, you know, I, I don't know how much you guys follow amateur golf, but I follow it quite a bit, you know, in those college ranks. You know, Sam Bennett was probably, you know, he's a previous USAM winner. Right. Right. I think he's sixth in the PGA Tour U. Um, they, they, did, they weren't talking about him. They were talking about that long ball hitter, Gordon Sargent. They were talking about all the other guys. And I think he took that personal. Like, mm-hmm. he played with a chip on his shoulder this yeah. week. You know, because his, his third round presser where he went in there and he's like, he's like, I play golf. I don't play golf swing. I don't have the prettiest swing. I don't right. hit it 354 yards. Like, that's a kid that's going to be a winner. Yeah. Well, you I know? mean, you're seeing how competitive, like, collegiate golf is because, I mean, he came out and did exceptionally well. Good head on his shoulders. But, like, a lot of guys are coming out first year on tour and winning. Yeah. You know, there is no PJ Tour hangover, get ready for the big show type thing anymore. No, I, I just really wanted him to finish in that top 12. I know. Same. Yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm, he still finished top 20. He'll be back next year. He'll be back, yeah. That's, I mean, he's going to be on the PJ Tour next year. He'll yeah. be a winner pretty soon, I think. Yeah. So. Yeah, I think, you know, obviously he had to – I don't know if you guys saw, but he elected not to play. Um, when he got back into town, he pulled out of the tournament. Mm. I don't think he needed to play. Mm-mm. I really don't. I think, especially with the golf marathon, as we'll call it, that they had to endure with the weather. I mean, it was kind of funny. He had to go to a sporting goods store and buy clothes because <laughs> yeah, he didn't have enough clothes. warmer, uh, you know, didn't have warm enough clothes. Uh, I'm really excited to see him in the future because I just think he had he brings a refreshment in terms of attitude. And like he said, you know, you know, hitting on what Nikki said, I'm not the most technical person. I just hit the ball. You know, I like to feel the shots and. Aside from a little bit of shaky putting in round three, which I think, you know, with who he was paired with, obviously, I think that played a little bit of a role. For sure. Um, but it was really nice to see him under pressure hit those clutch wedge shots greenside. I mean, it really was impressive. Yeah, he's got well, a good, good short game for sure. Yeah, I mean, and, and that's the thing. Great player. You could tell he's a great person. Um, I, I mean, I just – it's it's refreshing to see a guy come out that, like, you know – he, he's already owned his game. Like, he's right. just trying to be himself. So, like, he was – you know, to say to say at a presser, I've played a lot harder golf courses than this place. I was like, oh, the green jackets aren't <laughs> going to like that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>